What is up, everybody? Welcome back to another video on the Commander Caleb channel. Now, I know ha I haven't posted in a while, but here's going to be another post on my channel uh, for, like, um, just for, like, your po your average Pokemon fans out there. Now, today I'm going to be doing my rare Pokemon card collection. Now, it's not that big. The stack altogether is probably about that thick. So, I'm just going to be listing them off one by one and telling them where I got them. So, let's get started. Now, number one, I have my Mewtwo EX. Um, I got this from a uh, Mewtwo tin that I got at Walmart. And yeah, it's pretty cool. It's a nice EX. Like a Blastoise EX, I actually pulled out of a pack uh, the Mewtwo one to be exact, the Mewtwo tin. I pulled this out of the Evolutions pack. Pretty cool card. We have my only break, which is a carving break. It isn't that good. It only does 20 damage. It's a really bad break, but my friend gave it to me for free a long time ago, so I took it. Now we have a Lorantish GX. Now I got a booster box and I pulled one of these. It was a Sun and Moon booster box. Pretty cool card. Now we have gone to my Rainbow Rares. Only got two of them. This is the first one. This is a Raichu GX. Funny thing, actually, I got this out of a Raichu GX box and it wasn't even a prom promo. I just pulled it out of a pack. So that was really cool. It's a pretty cool card. Next we have an Umbreon GX. Um, I got this out of a booster box. The same Sun and Moon one. Yeah, it's a pretty cool card. Now we have a Lapras GX, which I also got out of the Sun and Moon booster box. So like five of them. Also got the Lorantis out of it. But yeah, pretty cool card. It's also a full art, so I love it. Now the first EX I ever got, which is out of a Magirna tin. You guys already know, it's Magirna EX. I love this card, and I'm, not, I'm never going to trade it because it's the first EX that I ever got. Second EX I ever got is the Rayquaza. Got this out of a Rayquaza tin, so yeah, I love it. It's a pretty cool card. Now, I uh, this was a trade that I got, but I have an Ultra Ball. Um, yeah, I, I traded this for another card. I forgot which one it was. I think it might have been the normal version of the Raichu. Not the Rainbow Rare one, but this is, as you guys can see, is a Secret Rare. This will focus. There, it's 61 out of... It's 161 out of 149, so yeah. Now, we have over here a Genesect EX, which I also got out of the Mewtwo tin. I pulled this out of a set, another pack, which is absolutely insane. So, yeah, it's a pretty cool card. Now, um, the two cards that I pulled out of the booster box besides these were the Solgaleo and the Lunala. I think that was kind of funny because these are the two main Pokemon of the whole Sun and Moon series. So, yeah, pretty cool cards. I, I love Solgaleo more because he just has more HP and his attacks are better. Now, we have my last EX of this, Charizard. This is also a base set, and I traded this. It's not in that good condition. It has some whitening on the back, but all around good card. Now, we're getting into the OGs. Starting off, this is the reprint, but it's still a really good card. Executor. I traded this with a friend. And it's a reprint, but it's still a very, uh, it's a pretty rare card. Now, the next one, this is an OG from 1999. This is a Koga's Golbat. Um, I traded this also, and it's a really good card. Um, another one from 1999 is a Nidorina. I'm just going to go by this pretty quick. Another one from 1999, which is my first one, Vileplume. Um, a Rhyhorn, which actually has a first edition symbol on it, so I think that's really neat. It's a first edition Rhyhorn from 1999, as you guys can see. Now, my favorite card out of all my cards that I've said... All these cards over here, I love them to death. But this one takes a cake. This is like a 1999 Japanese card that I traded. It even has the back. I love this card so much, and I would never trade it for the world. I love this card. It's not that good of a Pokemon, but it's in Japanese, and it's from um, the um, base set. But, um, as you can see on the Japanese cards, they don't have the thing, like the, um, the date. On an American card, this is the Rhyhorn First Edition. As you guys can see, this will focus. It says, uh, 1999 Wizards of the Coast. This one doesn't say it. It's just like how all Japanese cards are. They're just, um, they just, uh, don't have that. Now, my last card of this is not an OG, but I just wanted to show it off. It's just a shiny potion. It's a pretty cool card. I just kind of like it because it's like cool, shiny, and stuff. Now, that was my Pokemon card collection. Hope you guys like, comment, and subscribe on this video. 
And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.